Good morning dear students and parents. Welcome back to UKG English Revision class. Today we are going to revise a few more topics which you'll need to practice. So come let's begin. Days of the week. How many days are there in a week? How many days are there children? Yes, very good. There are seven days in a week. Okay, name them now. Number one, Sunday. Number two, Monday. Number three, Tuesday. Number four, Wednesday. Number five, Thursday. Number six, Friday. And number seven, Saturday. Children, you all need to memorize these days along with their spellings. The next topic, parts of the body. Look at the first picture, children. Very good. Eyes. Next, nose. Look at this. Very good. Ears. Lips. Look at this picture, children. Hand. Look at this. Leg. And this, neck. And what's the last picture, children? Teeth. Very good, children. You all need to memorize these parts of the body along with their spellings. Our next revision topic is rhyming words. Children, you all have learned rhyming words. So now you have to write them. So come, let's start. The first word, give. And the rhyming word for give is live. L I V E live. Look children, the first letter is different and the remaining letters are the same. Next word, ring. R I N G ring. S I N G sing. Next, table. T A B L E table. C A B L E cable. Cold, C O L D cold, T O L D told, L A M P lamp, C A M P camp. I have given just a few words here. For example, children, you'll need to memorize this from your spelling list. Our next topic is match the following. Children, you'll have to match. The words in the first column with the words in the second column. So come, let's begin. First line, A, a cow. You have to match a cow with one of these words. Fa, no. Coat, no. A cow lives in a shed. Yes, so we will write A. B, near. You have to match the word near. Near, fa, yes. Fa is the opposite of near. So you will write B. Next line, C. Boat. You have to match boat with one of these words. Coat. Yes, these are rhyming words. So you will write C. Next word, Saturday. Saturday, two eyes. Does, does this match? No. Saturday, last day of the week. Yes. So you will write D. Next line, I have. Only one line is left. I have two eyes and these two match. So you are writing E. Children, you all need to practice matching. Our next topic is answer these questions. As you can see, I have given you a few questions. For example, you need to answer them. So come, let's start writing. A. What is this? Look at this picture, children. What is this? Yes, this is a wheel. So you will write T H I S this I S is a wheel. W H E E L and a full stop. Next, B. Where is the bowl? Look at this picture. You can see a mat and a bowl. Where is the bowl, children? Yes, it is on the mat. So you will write the B O W L bowl is on the mat and use a full stop. C. Who cooks food for you? 
Do you know who cooks food for you? Yes, your mother. So you will write my mother cooks food for me. Next question D. What do you taste with? What do you taste with children? Yes, your tongue. I taste with my tongue. T O N G U E. Children, you all need to practice these type of questions and answers. Our next topic is make sentences. Children, you have to read the given word and make a sentence. So our first word is brush. Can you make a sentence with brush? Yes. I brush my teeth. And you must use a full stop when you finish your sentence. Next word, grass. Can you make a sentence with grass children? Yes, grass is green. Full stop. Next word, seat. The seat is wet. Next word. Near. Make a sentence with near children. The park is near my house. Full stop. And the last word. Tail. A cow has a long tail. So children, you all need to practice making sentences. Parents, you need to help your children to practice all these topics and do their worksheets properly when the worksheets will be uploaded on their school website. Thank you.